What's going on everybody? It's Josh. Today is Tuesday, September 5th. It is the day after Labor Day, obviously, and I am not ready for this week. As you guys well know, it was Kenny's, shout out to that motorcycle, it was Kenny's wedding this weekend and I am just falling behind on sleep. I actually tried to go hunting yesterday and I filmed a little bit, but I completely trashed that footage because I don't know I just didn't like it but the one thing I did pick up that I did not film was this Royal Guard black series figure I found it at my local Kroger so if you guys have a Kroger near you I would start hitting them now because with Force Friday and everything they put out a whole new shipper palette display thing so for sure go check those out in the Kroger marketplaces I believe is what they're doing so I'm going to try to go to Meyer and Walmart and the post office today. I'm on lunch right now, so I don't know how much I'll get done, but I need to go to the post office now and probably hit a Meyer. Because yesterday when I was hunting, I saw the new metallic Power Ranger figures and I want to go pick those up. But like I said, I didn't film stuff. I didn't film enough, I didn't do whatever, I don't know. I just, I just wasn't happy with it, so I'm just going to completely redo it. And I'm just being honest with you guys. So I do know those figures are still there, so it's not going to be a big shock, but hopefully they might have replenished some of their Star Wars stuff from Force Friday. But either way, I hope you guys are having a good day, and I hope that your guys' Force Friday went well. So, down in the comments below, tell me what you guys got. So, I'll see you guys at Meyer. So, here at Meyer, like I said, I've already been here, so I know what to expect, but I just want to show you guys the Rangers. Here we have the black, yellow, and pink, and as you can see, they come with their weapons, which is pretty dope now. They're not as shiny as I wish they would be. It's, I don't know. If I unbox them at any point, I'll make sure to do a video of it and give you guys a closer look. But I'm for sure picking up these three. So now all I need is the blue and the red. But I'll give you guys a quick overview of what we have. Looks like two cases were set out of the Guardian's Wave. And the, this peg was full, so it looks like one or two figures have gone. And hopefully they restock on the Thor Wave at some point. And with the Star Wars section, we have Vader and Rey left over. And face looks decent. I'll for sure be picking her up. I did get him from Kokomo. Got him for $18 shipped. So shout out to Kokomo Toys on that one. And then here, just the random. And some Transformer stuff. I'm going to have to go quick because I still need to go to the P.O. Box. I only have an hour for lunch, so... cool so anyways here's a couple of transformer stuff and then that big megatron still here so i'm gonna go pay for these and try to get out of here i'll probably be doing a po unboxing later on in this video um maybe after the gym or possibly tomorrow i'll go back to walmart either way i gotta go to the post office so i will see you guys soon so it is now after work and we are going to uh oh so one of my boxes that came in the P.O. box earlier was smashed like this. So I went ahead and opened it. Um, and I'll obviously show you guys what that is. But we're trying to get the kids rallied up. Nine, six, Buddy. Nine, Parker. Hey. Hey. You ready to go to the store? Um, no. Okay. No. So we're going to go to Walmart and see what remnants they have left of Force Friday stuff. And uh, yeah, so I guess we'll see you there. Okay, so we are in the toy section of Walmart. And as I mentioned earlier, I was here before, yes, or I was here yesterday. So I kind of know what's here, but I wanted to refilm it because I just didn't like it. So anyways, let's show you what's left over from Force Friday. Old Man Luke is still here. Vader, uh, Ray, Kylo, Vader, Vader. Old Man Luke another kylo and another vader vader and vader i think vader is unfortunately going to be the peg warmer just because hasbro just released him he's about the only repack per se besides the stormtroopers but people will buy 20 stormtroopers and it doesn't matter pop wise nothing different than yesterday uh, they had a leia pop here but it was kind of banged up i think that would be gone yeah, because it, it was right there. So I don't think she's here any longer. And for the multiverse, looking Super Friends, Green Lantern, and Batman. 
yeah, nothing. There's the Jim Gordon, but other than that, I think that's about it for that. And for the legends, Loki, Odinson, Thor, Nebula, Thor, yeah. Oop, nothing. Nothing new. So I wish I would have been recording when I just found this, but I was coming over because there's another aisle like this right here is like the toy aisle, I guess you could say, because Star Wars, Legends, all that stuff. And I saw that they had these, the little micro machine things. And I freaking walk over. And there's three damn stormtroopers just sitting here. So I'll be picking up those. And then I found the Darth Vader, um, what is it called, Black Series centerpiece statue. If this ever goes on clearance or on sale, okay, shout out to the shout out to that lady ruining my video. Um, I'll probably end up picking it up because it actually is a cool statue. I'd like to see some reviews on it. So yeah, 100%, um, three, well, there's two. I don't think I can fit three in my hand. Nope, I cannot. Nope. Okay, so uh, three, oh my god. So three more stormtroopers will be coming home with me. And I would also like to share with you guys the new Lego sets. You've probably already seen them if you guys went out for Force Friday, but these two are my absolute favorites. I will 100% be getting this and this. And I'm not gonna lie, over time, I'll probably pick up a couple of each. And then this uh, Kylo Ren's TIE Fighter is pretty sweet. BB-8 I'm not really in on. Um, this one, nah. Vice Admiral Haldo, whatever. Resistance Gunner Page. So I don't know if those are legit characters or if they're just gonna be like quick mentions. Then we have the advent calendar. And at some point I still need to pick up a couple of these because I love these little tanks. And then this thing's pretty cool too. It looks a little weird, but at the same time until you see the movie you really don't know what you're gonna get with it. So we are walking out of Walmart and I got something in this bag, but I can't say it out loud because uh, somebody's birthday is Saturday and I can't really talk about it at this moment, but I will show you just because. What? Your birthday's not Saturday. Yes, it is. No. -uh. My birthday's September 9th. So that, uh, that did not go like I thought it would go. But I'll show, whoa, that sun is bright, but I'll show you guys real quick. So as you can see, I got one, two, three stormtroopers, and then I got Riley this for her birthday. Cause you know, we gotta keep it Star Wars in this family. So, any, so anyways. What? Yeah, that's great. So that is the trip for Walmart. That's gonna be the hunt for this video probably um, because I can't go to Walgreens and I can't go to GameStop because we have to get home. So hopefully the next clip you will see is the small PO unboxing. There's only two, two or three boxes, but anyways, I'll see you guys at home. Okay, so we are back home, switched cameras and everything. Um, so once again, I will apologize if the audio is a little weird, it's because I'm using a different camera. Before I start that, I mentioned earlier in the video that I opened a box because it was a little smashed. Now, I wanna give a huge shout out to Cody or Dark Side Collector, he is a fellow YouTuber. So his link will be down in the description below. He hooked it up with this trade. You guys know I've kind of been after horror pops. Um, I have my Friday the 13th and I have my Predator pops and I got that Reagan or Regan pop, whatever you're from The Exorcist. And we all know the hype. So I did hop aboard the hype train and I did a trade with him for this pop. It is the Pennywise Chase. As we all know, the hype has been real on this because something with the licensing issue on this certain pop pretty much skyrocketed the value and he went to Walmart and found like two or three chases in like two days. And I've, I don't know, I feel like I've been talking to him since he started his YouTube. So he's, he's legit a friend of mine. He's not just someone that I hit up once I saw he found a chase like I don't know and he did a beyond fair trade so Cody shout out to you dude so everyone please if you're watching this video take like 15 seconds go down to the description below go to his channel show him some love for me so I can show him even more appreciation for doing this even trade instead of scalping the shit out of this so for real Cody shout out to you man so my next 
package is another trade so I'm happy to finally get this hopefully the box looks a little smashed so I hope it's in good condition and this is another chase that I've been after well I just ruined it it's another pop chase that I've been after for a while and this one is the Punisher chase now I've said plenty of times about not watching the Daredevil series and all this and blah 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 I finally finished it I'm still like halfway through the Defenders and once I saw the end of Daredevil, I 100% wanted this chase because honestly I appreciate the Punisher more after watching that show. So I want to give a huge shout out to Jason Molina for this trade dude. It was a chase for chase so in my opinion very 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 fair and I'm happy to finally have this badass in my collection. This package is from Arthur, a fellow YouTuber. You guys would know him better as Unboxing Art. He is also a Syndicate family member. Um, he actually won like my 500 subscriber giveaway or I don't know he won one of my giveaways when I gave away that Captain America Marvel Legends and we did a trade I'm super excited to see this I already see something hilarious in here looks like there's a quite a few notes or something in here oh my god I, <laughs> um, I can't show I cannot uh can't show this this is uh this will get my video flagged but i will just let you guys know it is darth vader um drawn as a uh, male body part <laughs> oh my god actually oh man i nope i can't do it i can't do it okay this is this is friendly uh it says josh hope you like the pig lol enjoy the blank i don't want to spoil it as I know they are going to a, into a collection and home that appreciates them. The four bonus items I hope you like. Yes, four, so make sure you didn't throw any away. They were part of my childhood and were with me all these years, minus the pen. Wish you and your family. Wow, okay. So shout out to Arthur Yoel. Hopefully I said that right. Oh, this is a dope ass. Look at this. Sp Spider-Man with the beanie on. <laughs> now I feel like I need to... I feel like I need to put my beanie on. I don't know where it's at though. Uh, but yeah, dude, this is super dope drawing. Thank you, dude. That is awesome. So let's get into the package. Uh, this will go well because I got buttons on Force Friday. But here is a uh, a Death Star button. Hopefully, you guys can see that. I'll give a close up at the end. But so now I gotta go through this like super. Oh shit! No way. These are. Uh... These are little micro machines. I'll do a close up later. But I actually have like one, two, three. I have five micro machine play sets. So this, when I open those, these will go perfect in there, dude. Thank you so much. I played with these as a kid too. So the first item in our actual trade is another Royal Guard. So this makes my third. And keeping with the tradition, another Royal Guard. So now I have four Royal Guards total. I'm trying to get six because eventually once I have some space, I want to line six up um, and then have the Emperor and Darth Vader like coming down the middle or whatever, kind of like a Return of the Jedi thing. I don't know. Oh, go. Oh. I'm gonna make sure there's nothing in here before I... Oopsie. Uh. So these are two Star Wars figures. This is Vader. So this is actually pretty dope. This is a, a Darth Vader. It has a removable helmet and it has a soft goods cape. And I am not aware of what figure this would be. So I'll give you guys a close up of it um, at the end and maybe, and maybe you can help me out. And then the second little guy that he sent me was a little Yoda. This is 98, so I'm assuming that's around the power of the force years but who's that little guy so dude Arthur thank you so much man for for the hookups this is uh this is pretty dope I'm the most stoked for these little micro machine things so thank you very much everybody uh Jason Arthur Cody uh like I said Cody and Art's links will be down in the description below so please 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 go show them some love for me so I'm going to get all of this because uh, I have a tripod. I invested into a tripod now and I have a microphone and a stand coming for my phone. So when I live stream, uh, things will be a little clearer. So I'm slowly trying to put some money 
into my equipment setup. So that might take away from my fig money for a little bit. But anyways, I'm gonna break all this stuff down and then I'm going to grab my other camera and show you guys a close up of everything, including the haul portion that I got from Walmart and Meyer, and then give you guys a little bit of a close up on the stuff I got from my PO box. So with all this cleaned up, let me show you a little closer of what I got. So once again, I got the Chase Punisher, the Chase Pennywise, and then here is a little better look of the micro machines. So obviously some scout troopers, and I think I saw a Dengar and a Bosk in there somewhere. And this was the little Yoda art scent. And this is the Vader. He has articulation at the knees and a soft good cape. The date on the bottom says 1998, so once again Power of the Force, but I'm not sure like where it came from. Because that, uh, that helmet comes a little focus. And the helmet comes off as well, so not too sure. And here hopefully is a closer look of the rangers for you guys if you can tell like i was trying to explain in the store they're really not like metallic-y it's more just like a flat shiny finish if that makes any sense whatsoever so i got the pink yellow black still need that red and blue and then obviously i got two of those and then i got three of these but i don't really need to lay all of those out because they're the same so that's going to do it for this video sorry if it was on the shorter side i just wanted to get something out relatively soon and with force friday happening um i kind of bought everything that i wanted to buy right away because if you guys don't know um, there's a toy show for me coming up on sunday and it is up in columbus so if any of you local people are watching i will put the flyer right here um i will be going possibly kenny possibly karina and i guess i'll spoil it in some way since he's probably going uh, Foxy for real and Joey from Archaic TV is going to be joining us as well. So that's going to be a huge video if everybody comes. Actually, that made that made no sense because I know everybody is coming. The only person is possibly is Cincy, so I don't know. It doesn't matter. But anyways, I'm going to cut this video off because now I'm just having diarrhea at the mouth. I don't understand what I'm saying and it's not making any sense. As always, make sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. If you guys are new, please hit that subscribe button. Trust me, look forward to this coming video. Make sure to tune into the live stream this Saturday because Foxy, Joey, possibly Kenny, and maybe Karina will be joining me on that. So probably expect another three hour live stream, not gonna lie. Thank you guys for all the support. It literally, it just means the world to me that the Force Friday video blew up and I couldn't be happier with that. It was one of the most fun videos that I've filmed in a very, very, very long time. So I hope you guys have a good week. I hope you guys are getting some good stuff. If you guys got some sweet stuff on Force Friday, Keep checking because I know stores are already restocking and I know Toys R Us has put out Wave 2. Walmart has been putting out the three and three quarter figures that aren't supposed to be out until like November, but they're hitting shelves already. So way to go Walmart. But that's going to do it for me, guys. I will see you in the next video. And as always, may the figs be with you.